Welcome back guys to this YouTube video and real quick I just wanted to show Nike's newest pack the progress pack um, I honestly didn't do my research as to why they call that um, does anybody else get tired of that those things like I know for Nike they have meaning um, but do we really buy the boots because of the names of the packs you know you had you just have weird they just have weird meanings to me anyway i'm just well just just release the boot with the colorway and i think it'll be fine i don't know maybe i'm wrong maybe i'm just too old now for this stuff but i guess if it inspires you guys that's all that matters but anyway let's take a look at it uh, my first impressions look at my boot came already like someone had been wearing it honestly looks like somebody's been wearing this um, and as if, if you haven't realized Nike is having um, I what I think they haven't came out and said it but obviously with COVID um, there's been a lot of shipping delays and stuff um, I will look on like soccer.com first and um, they have the boots you can purchase them, but they're, you know, on back order to like crazy dates like July. I forgot like the Phantom a G2, GT2, the orange colorway, I believe. Um, that is like back order till July. And Nike doesn't even have them on their website. The Temples, um, which I really want because it's almost like this color. Actually, one of them is this color. Um, and then they have a black and gold, but I guess it's the shadow pack. I'm not sure exactly. Um, but I really want to get my hands on those two, um, boots, of course. Um, but they're like back order and not even showing up on Nike's website. So I believe, I don't think it's a manufacturing issue. Um, I just think that, um, with shipping and stuff, COVID has really, um, messed that up. Uh, but I guess these are kind of cool. They're not white. They look white probably. Um, but they're like, well, let's look up the official colorway. Uh, football gray and black and blue, it says. Yeah. I don't know. Weird name for colorways, but. Oh, yeah, that's. It kind of. They kind of um, remind me of um, the. What was it? The Ronaldo, the Superfly chapter. Was it chapter five, maybe? The Diamond? kind of kind of that's what they remind me of um but again this is it's not different just um design elements i guess are different uh do you guys are you guys a fan of the swooshes like all those different swooshes and stuff um and then back here it's weird because i think this is supposed to be like the same type of color but it kind of is like a lavender color um so they almost look like you know, when you get a pair of white boots and you get them dirty and then you're trying to keep them clean and washing them every time, which not a lot of people probably do, but I am one of those persons that does. Um, but uh, not, nothing too special about them, um, but pretty cool, I guess. Um, when the light hits them, they do change color a little bit. So um, if you, let me know, what do you guys think? Does Nike release too many? I think I've talked about this before. I think they do way too many um, colorways in such short amount of time, but that's just me. Um, I keep up with them just to make videos. Other than that, I probably wouldn't. And I don't know, I may play in these a few and return them. <laughs> uh, I may keep them, I'm not sure yet. Um, I like the colors, don't get me wrong. Um, but I think, I think they would have looked nice just on a, a white boot, but I feel like many people stay away from the white boots nowadays because this might this might not be hard to clean but i feel the this part is hard to clean could be just me but i don't know anyways guys with that being said thank you for watching um stay tuned for more videos we'll see you guys in the next one peace